There's never been a better time to sell or trade your used car or truck. Davenport Auto Park is ready to buy your pre-loved vehicle. The market is hot for used cars and we're paying top dollar. Drive into Davenport today and turn your car into cash. You'll get a cash offer on the spot. We'll even pay off your loan and give you a ride home. Or we'll help you pick out a new ride. Davenport Auto Park, Rocky Mount. For the ride of your life and the life of your ride. Davenport Auto Park, Rocky Mount. Welcome to Cuisine with Jean. We have got Zabdil Duar. Thank you. No problem, ma'am. <laughs> of the chill spot. And y'all might have gone to his restaurant when it was on Washington Street. In fact, I had the pleasure of coming there because you were Small Business of the Month. Yes, ma'am. And now you, when Prime Smokehouse moved, you took that location yes, and it's larger and it's wonderful. It's and you're much better. Good. And you've got room beside it for your food truck. Yes, ma'am. To park in the lot. And before we get any farther into this, you know how you hear online people are going to restaurants and looking at the, the how they score with, with cleanliness and whatnot? Uh, Z has had only 100, only, and how many times? Six times in a row, six inspections. Wow. I, don't, I just, it's so rare to even see a 100. Tell us why you always score them. I mean, I know um, you're doing the right thing, but it's, it's to your, you are committed to that, aren't you? Yes, ma'am. Well, you know, culturally, it's, you know, from a child, you know, your, your parents would instill in you, get up, clean your room, do this, do that. It's, it's, it's in, in you. Mm -hmm. So, you know, having a restaurant, we are closed on Mondays. Mm -hmm. Mondays, what we do, we take all the furniture out, we have it washed, we have everything in the kitchen cleared out, washed, clean. Um, you know, we follow every code mm -hmm. that we are given. You know, the refrigerators, the freezers, um, it's a team effort. Mm -hmm. It's a team effort, and I must say, I have an awesome team. Um, they do the right thing. Obviously, and we've but had they've got good leadership, though. Yes, I mean, you, yes, you do what, I, what the leaders tell you to do. True. Um, and we've had, in three years, we've had six inspections. We received all 100. That's, congratulations. Perfect. I Thank love you very that. Much. Absolutely. And we, what are you making today? Okay, so we're doing something quick, something easy, but it's also very tasty. Uh -huh. We're doing Caribbean style coconut buttered shrimp. Oh, yeah. So it's going to be a whole lot of flavor, a whole lot of colors. Mm -hmm. um, it's not spicy. Mm -hmm. It's not spicy today, <laughs> but it's going to be a whole lot of flavor, a whole lot of juices. Okay, you want to get it started, then I'm going to yep. talk more about your jerk chicken and okay. some of your best sellers. Because okay. when I was there for Small Business of the Month, you had steady traffic all afternoon. Yes, ma'am. Um, it wasn't just at mealtime. They were coming in, and I know you do a lot of takeout, right? Yes, ma'am. We do a whole lot of takeout. Um, takeout is the biggest share of our market. Um, you know, COVID had contributed to that somehow. Um, where, you you know, had moved right about yes, that time, didn't yes. you? That was probably a little tough. Yes. Um, we, just when COVID hit, um, you know, and then we moved to another location, and then we basically had to start over. You know, a lot of persons didn't know our new location. Google didn't update us yet, so we had some oh. glitches. Um, but we do have quite a lot of takeout customers, mm -hmm. quite a lot of calling customers who will come and pick up. Um, we do plan on going back to full dining. Good. As in, um, with, you know, traditional silverware, plates, porcelain. Um, we are working on getting a full staff because I do not believe that a customer should wait 30, 40 minutes for a meal. Mm -hmm. I want persons to be in, have your meal, enjoy, have fun, have a drink, feel like you're in Jamaica. If, if it's Saturday or Sunday, you've got the music to support it, right? Yes, ma'am. Live band? Yes, ma'am. Uh, we have just uh, started live bands. Uh -huh. So once per month, we have a live band. Every day we have music in the chills, but it's always going to be music. It's always going to be a good vibe. It's just We just want it to be a place where everybody know I can go and chill. Mm -hmm. It's a... The chill spot. The I mean. chill spot. <laughs> you know, you come and you chill. Uh -huh. um, it's, we are very diverse. We want everybody to feel welcome. Mm -hmm. Just come on in, grab a seat, drink something at the bar, get something to eat. And your bar traffic, I mean, that's a beautiful bar coming yes, in the door. And, and that does really well, on, especially on weekends, correct? Like yes, Friday, Saturday nights? It does, it does. And you know, persons, they'll tell you one drink is enough. 
Huh. Wine drink is an. <laughs> Are they mainly island dress yes, drinks? Yes. Yes. Okay. Uh, we do. I would say ninety-five percent of what you're gonna see is gonna be what you'd see in Jamaica. Okay. We do have a small 5%, but we are mostly a rum, tequila, mm -hmm. uh, vodka type bar. Mm -hmm. mm. Well, let's get started. On All the right, trip. so um, we've added our butter mm -hmm. as we do not use oil. Okay. We do not use oil. All nice we're doing like fried chicken, fried fish. Mm -hmm. Everything else is cooked in butter. Okay. Um, so we don't want to turn this up too high, but and all of your food is, is authentic Jamaican Authentic cuisine. Jamaican, 100% authentic. As a matter of fact, most of our seasonings, we get them from Jamaica. Hi. We do get meat locally, mm -hmm. but our seasonings, our curry, our jerk, uh, our powders, that sort of thing that we use, we get it from Jamaica. Mm -hmm. Things like onions, bell peppers, we do get those locally. Mm -hmm. But those um, Jamaican seasonings, straight from the yard. Mm. So we're gonna add some Onions, some bell peppers. Mm, they're beautiful. We're gonna, and that's it. We want it to be beautiful. We have some carrots because you know carrots give it that sweet. Well, and, and speaking of, we want it to be beautiful. You, that's really part of what the emphasis. I mean, to have okay. the food be such that people want to take pictures of it. Yeah. Right when they. You know, that's that's the world we live in. Know that you know, someone gets their plate. The first thing, let me take a picture. Good. You know, so we want to make sure that that picture is oh. representing us in the real way. Persons will see what it is. Um, did you have a restaurant in Jamaica before you moved here? Yes, I did. I had a, a, what we call a jerk pit. So we did mostly jerk. We had actual jerk pits. Mm -hmm. um, because jerk in its truest form. Okay, turn this up a little bit yes. so it'll sizzle. Yes. But we don't want to set off the, fire, the <laughs> smoke alarms. <laughs> so Sprinklers. In its truest form, the jerk is about cooking on wood. Pimento wood, to be exact. Pimento wood. Pimento. So pimento is a, a some small balls, um, small black seeds. They, they look like um, they're full of flavor. Now mm -hmm. we use a, a tree, the mm -hmm. wood, and that's what it's cooked on. The flavor from the pimento tree mm -hmm. goes inside the chicken. Mm. So. And you do that here too. You get that wood here. Are you well, going? unfortunately, because we have to abide by fire codes and. Um, health codes, we cannot have a live fire in the okay. kitchen. So we do, however, have a grill. Mm -hmm. We have a secret way to get pim the pimento flavor in it. Great. And I'm sorry, people, I can't okay. share. <laughs> but that's why you get that pimento flavor. Um, but as I said, because of health code, because of fire codes, we cannot have a live fire. Uh -huh. So in, in all honesty, we would be about 90% authentic there mm -hmm. because we can't do something. We're just not allowed. Now, know. when we put that grill on the outside, uh -huh. because we have a big, I think you guys call it pig cooker, uh -huh. then we can add our pimento wood, throw everything inside, and that's the real deal. But if you get 90%, I mean, that that's great that you have figured out a technique, yes. a secret technique, yes. that you can do that. Yes, yes. So is this going to be cooked to what point? I mean, is it cooked all the way and then you add the shrimp or how to Yes, we make sure that the vegetables are cooked. Um, these are all um, cooked shrimp. Mm -hmm. Right um, here. So they won't take a long time to be cooked. Um, we make and sure. What's, what's in there now? We have butter? bell peppers, um, onions, carrots, um, and it, it's been sauteed in butter. Oh, okay. So there was butter in there before yes. you added those? No, because the butter has some level of salt, we don't add much salt to it. We're going to uh -huh. add some seasoning but not a lot because uh -huh. we don't want it too salty. We don't want to get anybody's pressure too high, you know. But um, the event center has been a real boon for you too, yes. hasn't it? Yes, ma'am, it has been. Good, it has I'm been. glad. And I've, I've had people from out of town come here and say, you know, we want to go to your local restaurants, which I always say, yes, we want you to go to our local restaurants. But you personally have been real pleased with the, with yes. the, the traffic from there. I have, I have. The event center has been operating and they've been having tournaments volleyball tournaments, uh, basketball tournaments, and you know, that's bringing a couple thousand persons on a weekly basis. Mm -hmm. um, we are there just beside the event center. Persons will see our feather banners. They will look online. They will see that oh, they're highly rated. We do authentic. Um, they'll see our reviews, and they'll come try us. Mm -hmm. Some persons, it's the first time having Jamaican food, and what means the most to us is when we have those persons and they say, oh, it was good. It was mm -hmm. great. It's excellent. I'll be back. Um, so yes, the event center does bring a lot of traffic. 
So if I came in there and I'd never had Jamaican food before and I'd say, help me know what I should try, mm -hmm. what would you tell me? Well, I, I, I always say to persons, you have to tell me some more because depending on what your palate is, depending on what you may like the most, one person may like spicy, the other may like sweet. Mm -hmm. So if I were to tell a person who likes sweet, jerk chicken, they may not enjoy it. But I, I will tell persons, if you like spicy, always mm -hmm. go jerk. If you like sweet, say in a brown stew. Brown stew chicken, brown stew fish, brown stew shrimp. If you like something that's savory, curry. Curry is always a good option. We do oxtail, we do uh, snapper whole fish, um, and we do it in maybe six or seven ways. We can steam it, brown stew, curry, roast, jerk, fried, escovish. And you have a regular menu with yes, some specials sometimes, yes, if you can get some extra stuff? Yes ma'am. Okay. So we have um, different items on the menu, um, and you know, we know the, what the economy is like, so we have budget friendly mm -hmm. items as well. We have uh, chicken plates from 550. What? Yes, ma'am. And, and if I remember correctly from when I was there before, you're generous with your portions. Yes, we are. <laughs> we are. We are. We try to make sure you get value you for your money. You didn't get this tall without having generous portions, <laughs> right? <laughs> no, ma'am. I tell you what, let's take a break and we'll finish that and then you can add the shrimp and talk about that and we'll learn more about your restaurant. No problem. Thank you and very you much. First, folks, he is amazing. He's had lots of jobs here. Um, I don't think you can find a more <laughs> industrious, hardworking person. Thank you, ma'am. So we'll Thank be you. right back. There's never been a better time to sell or trade your used car or truck. Davenport Auto Park is ready to buy your pre-loved vehicle. The market is hot for used cars and we're paying top dollar. Drive into Davenport today and turn your car into cash. You'll get a cash offer on the spot. We'll even pay off your loan and give you a ride home. Or we'll help you pick out a new ride. Davenport Auto Park, Rocky Mount. For the ride of your life and the life of your ride. Davenport Auto Park, Rocky Mount. Welcome back. See, if people have not been to, to Chill Spot, yes, they need to because folks, during the break we were talking, he has people driving from Virginia, South Carolina, all over, in fact, from South Carolina monthly. Monthly. Raleigh, Eastern North Carolina. Raleigh. So, um, and, and it's here, it's ours. <laughs> so we're <laughs> glad you're here. Yes, ma'am. But these are people who want authentic yes. Jamaican food, yes. right? Um, you know, most of these persons will tell you, They've been told that we're authentic, they've been to Jamaica, they have friends, family who are Jamaicans and they tell them, go to the chill spot, it's worth the drive. So we actually have one family, they're from South Carolina and they're every month, religiously, right. they already purchase 10, 12 meals. They'll eat some and take some with them every single month. Wow. We have persons who will be traveling from New York going down, they'll stop off, and then on their way back, they'll stop off. <laughs> and, you know, it's, it's, it's a good feeling. Uh -huh. It's a good feeling. Uh-huh. Oh, well, and when I was in your restaurant before you moved, I mean, like I said, the portions are very generous. Yes, yes. We, generous. we try to give you value for your money. Oh, you do. You do. Tell us what you've added now, the coconut milk powder. Coconut, and coconut powder. Um, Where and can you get that? In regular grocery stores? Or um, do you have to order it? It's, it's not as easy to find the coconut powder. Some places will, Mexican um, supermarkets will have coconut milk. Okay. Um, that can be used as well. Okay. Um, we use the coconut powder, mm -hmm. um, but we use the coconut milk in our rice. Oh. So when we're cooking rice and peas. And I have we, seen coconut milk for sure in yes. grocery stores. So, so we're just going to add a little bit more. Okay. And this is seasoned up. All purpose. All purpose so this is Maggie season of all purpose. Um, you can add whatever flavor you like. Um, some persons don't use some things because of the amount of salt. Some persons want less salt. Some persons want more salt. Mm -hmm. um, Maggie is a Jamaican brand. A brand. Well, a brand that we use in Jamaica a lot. Mm -hmm. um, so you know, it's something you, you you were born and raised using Maggie. So and you're waiting till this gets soft. The yes. peppers and onions and carrots get soft. Yes, well, yeah. And when you add the shrimp, do you serve this over something? Or? Yes. 
You, we usually serve it over a bit of rice with uh, steamed cabbages and something called ripe plantains. So ripe plantains is from the family of bananas. Mm -hmm. um, it's not to be eaten raw. It will stain and burn you. Oh. So it's cooked. So you fry them. It has a dark color, but it is super sweet. Really? Like, I've, just, I've seen them and I've always heard about them, but I've never had one. So right. don't eat them raw. No, not raw. Even though it's similar to a banana, yeah. you do not eat it raw. Um, they can be fried either green mm -hmm. or ripe. Green, we usually sprinkle salt mm -hmm. on it, mm -hmm. and it has more of a chips taste. Ripe, the riper they are, and this is something a lot of persons know, the riper they are, the softer they are, mm -hmm. and the sweeter they are. And you fry them? You just fry them. In circles or in long? However you choose. Okay. Oh, which was now, if people wanted to, to go and see your food truck, where yes, do you take that? Uh, we take it wherever. Okay. I've been honest with you, we've been as far as Virginia and South Carolina. But if you want us to go to California, we'll <laughs> yeah. take it to California. But like if somebody were having a big party in a big field or something, could they call yes. you and have yes. you come? And if you want to have an event, you want to cook, we can just bring the food truck to your location. You don't need to cook, you don't need to clean up. We'll serve everybody. and. Uh, it will be easy for you, and your guests will be happy. I, I absolutely have no doubt about that. Yes, so, people as far away as they're, they're driving to come. I'm so glad that it was about a year and a half you, yes, moved, you relocated. Yes, I just tripped me down. Okay. You said a year and a half? Uh-huh, and, and just within the last, what, year after COVID, you're starting to see more and more people come. Yes, so. And how soon do you anticipate you'll do more dining in and, and have a real, kind of go ahead and completely outfit the dining area? Well, we've, we've already started the process of um, getting prepared to go back to full dining. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we are actually just waiting on human, human power uh, to ensure that we have a full staff. We do have quite a number of persons, but as I said, um, logistically, I want to ensure that if you're dining in, 15 minutes wait should be mm -hmm. enough. After you sit, I don't want to have you waiting more than 15 minutes to well, be served. Well, we love that because often people do wait longer. Now, you've got yes. four children. Yes. Um, do they help in the restaurant at all? <laughs> yes, they do. Oh, good. Yes, they do. The youngest one that helps is actually eight years old. And she, you know, we'll tell her, you know, when you get a little bit older, but um, even yesterday I gave her an opportunity, and I was surprised. She did remarkably well. Um, so she helps my older daughter and my older son you know they can cook mm -hmm. uh, they are uh, 12 11 and 13 they can cook they, they can cook this meal super um they help in the front they help doing meal prep uh dishwashing cleaning the air cleaning the bathrooms they do everything mm -hmm. what brought you to rocky mail oh my wife good uh, my wife is a teacher um she is a math and science specialist uh she was recruited uh, in Jamaica because North Carolina needed math specialists and they needed science specialists. She happened to be both. So she came here. At the time I was a police officer in Jamaica um, so I did not come immediately because I've always been to America, to New York, to Florida, to Philly, but I've never heard of Rocky Mount. So I was mm -hmm. like, I'm not going. I don't know where that is. <laughs> but then you know, I came here, it was a culture shock for me. Uh, moving from Kingston, a busy city, sure. to Rocky Mount, where at that time at eight o'clock, nothing. Uh -huh. So it was a big culture shock. I went back to Jamaica when I came because I was like, no, nah, I couldn't do this. But then, you know, I came back for the sake of my family, um, and I've adapted. And honestly, I do love it now. Yeah. You know, this if you is want no busy, home. You can go to some other towns like Raleigh and get real busy. <laughs> The shrimp, yes, these are gorgeous big shrimp there. Yes. They look like jumbo jumbo. Yes. How do you know when they're done? Because I've had some shrimp that's overdone. Easy rule. Okay. C is cooked. Mm -hmm. If it gets to O, it's overcooked. Just remember that. Once they get to the point where they curl as a C, uh -huh. they're cooked. Oh, the C curl. I was wondering what curl. you meant, like, because I always kind of look for the pink, and they're oh. a little bit pink there. But so you're saying they curl more? They curl more. When they're overcooked, they're going to be a complete O. Oh. They're going to touch. Okay, so you want to get them out while they're still yes. C. And, you know, visually, as you said, you know, you can look at the pink. The, the reason I do not necessarily tell persons to just look at the, the pink is because it depends on your flame level. Mm -hmm. They may get pink quicker. Okay. 
And, and this is a, a burner, so you're not, yes. you're having, no. this is like what you're Ooh. used to, is it? <laughs> so do you cook over flame all the time at the restaurant? Yes. Low and slow. Uh -huh. That's the way to go. Okay. Um, we, we, other than um, oxtail, which is pressured, mm -hmm. it has to be under high pressure um, because we have to cook it quickly. Um, at home, you'll use a slow cooker, cook it for eight hours. There's no way we could cook oxtail for eight hours. Our customers would be, they would crucify us. Mm -hmm. So we have to use pressure cookers mm -hmm. to cook oxtail in maybe 30, 40 minutes. Mm -hmm. um, so that is cooked on high flame. Most other things we actually cook on low flame. Keep it low, keep it slow, and it will be perfect. And what hours are you open? Because that time, like I said, when I yes, came, when you won the Chamber Award, all afternoon, it was middle of the afternoon, people were coming in. Yes, you, what hours are you open? So, um, on Sundays, we are open 12 to 7. Mm -hmm. We're closed on Mondays, and that's our cleanup day. That's to ensure that we keep at 100. Mm -hmm. Tuesdays, we are 12 to 8. Wednesdays, 11 to 8. Thursdays, 11 to 9. Fridays 11 to 11, Saturdays 11 to Sunday 1 a.m. Wow, yes, and all that's online. If yes, ma'am, all that's online. Okay. okay, well, Sandra Smith has been asking to join us because okay. she's been smelling this and, <laughs> and she is one of your biggest fans. She is. Um, so is that, that looks like C's. We're about <laughs> done there. They're almost just like this. You notice it's still uh -huh. kind of gray. Uh-huh. So. And you're also looking at the gray color too, yes. right, C? Okay, well, let's take a break and come back, then we'll and get to taste done. it. Okay, yes, be right back. There's never been a better time to sell or trade your used car or truck. Davenport Auto Park is ready to buy your pre loved vehicle. The market is hot for used cars, and we're paying top dollar. Drive into Davenport today and turn your car into cash. You'll get a cash offer on the spot. We'll even pay off your loan and give you a ride home. Or we'll help you pick out a new ride. Davenport Auto Park, Rocky Mount. For the ride of your life and the life of your ride. Davenport Auto Park, Rocky Mount. Folks, as you can imagine, this the whole studio smells like this fabulous shrimp. It smells shrimp. so good, Jean. <laughs> okay, so if people are watching this, and we will put the ingredients on our website, Cuisine with Jean, but if people come to, when they come to the Chill Spot, what do they ask for in order to get this? Uh, butter shrimp. Butter shrimp. Butter shrimp. And are there options with the butter shrimp, or it automatically yes. comes with them? Um, so some of our sides, we have plain white rice, uh, what we call rice and peas. You guys more call it rice and beans. We have callaloo rice. Now, callaloo is similar to collards. So it's a green leafy vegetable. So if you're looking for a, uh, a healthy option, uh, callaloo rice is, is very good. Uh -huh. um, we have fries. We have mac and cheese. We have callaloo. Mac and cheese? Is mac and cheese Jamaican? Um, it wouldn't, it's not like originated from Jamaica, but it's something we do consume uh -huh. in Jamaica a lot. Hence, mm -hmm. it's why we okay. have it on the menu. Well, and while we taste this, Sandra and I were complimenting you on the fact that she was in there the other day and one of your children. Tell us kind of, I mean, I think you you and your wife done a wonderful job. Yeah, your son was in there. Yes. Good work yes, ethic. We tried to, looks so good. No, work ethic mm. is, is something that my father taught me, and I try to instill it in my children as well. Um, don't expect anything to be given to you. Mm -hmm. Work for what you want. Mm -hmm. There's nothing wrong with wanting nice stuff. Work towards it. Mm -hmm. Set a goal, work towards it. Mm -hmm. And you will be able to accomplish it. So good. You might need to keep talking about so working. <laughs> well, I like that. <laughs> That's something I always big. say in a restaurant. Mm -hmm. Anytime mm -hmm. I have a customer and they're unable to speak, mm -hmm. I like that. You like that? They're busy eating. That's exactly they're right. And eating. you have a, as you said, you have a lot of takeout business. And I am a testament for you to that because. Um, when I'm in there, it is in and out, in and out, in mm -hmm. and out. I mean, I'm impressed. There's somebody coming in and out all the time. And how do you maintain, because I have, I've gotten takeout from places, mm. and it's just not nearly as good. So obviously you've mastered, besides 100% yes. um, safety rating or, mm -hmm. or cleanliness rating, you must really know how to keep it. Yes, what um, we have a plan that it actually works. Um, we know how long each meal will take to be prepared uh -huh. if it's something that's cooked to order. Uh -huh. So let's say we're going to do uh, shrimp um, and we know it's going to take 12 minutes. 
will tell you pick up in 15 minutes mm -hmm. to ensure that when you get there you pick up you're out mm -hmm. um, instead of just saying 10 minutes and then you're there you're waiting you have somewhere to go carry mm -hmm. the kids to the game no we respect person's time wow. mm. so impressed come yeah. and see Zabdiel absolutely and when people come from the event center then do they take it and eat it like we're gonna have around and we have a mixture we have some persons who will eat in and then we have another set who let us grab and go they probably have to go back to the game yeah. right 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 miss something so yes. it's good that you have such a good takeout um you know it's a well-oiled machine the system, for yes. all these takeouts mm -hmm. yes. you know so yes. and what's your website uh, D Chill Spot Jamaican Restaurant, or just Google us, just search D Chill Spot, and you'll see us. You can order on Carry Out Cabby or DoorDash if you want to do home delivery. Oh, mm. good. Okay. Very good. That sounds Thank wonderful. you for being with us. Yeah, thank, thank you very you. much for Hope having me, Santana. Yeah, and, definitely. Y'all need to go in his restaurant. Come on. Come, 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 come. Come on down to the Chill <laughs> Spot. And when, when are you having Jamaican music there again? Uh, March 4, we're having a live band, Crucial Fire. Come on, it's gonna be fun. And if it's if this shows after March, then when would it be in April? Do you know? Um, and we like haven't decided on the exact date, but it's usually gonna be about the first Sunday in April. Okay, okay. Yes. And sit there at the bar and eat some great Jamaican food. Listen to some music. music. You feel just like you're in Jamaica. I promise you that much. Great. Thank you. Thank you very much, man. Thank you for joining us too. There's never been a better time to sell or trade your used car or truck. Davenport Auto Park is ready to buy your pre-loved vehicle. The market is hot for used cars and we're paying top dollar. Drive into Davenport today and turn your car into cash. You'll get a cash offer on the spot. We'll even pay off your loan and give you a ride home. Or we'll help you pick out a new ride. Davenport Auto Park, Rocky Mount. For the ride of your life and the life of your ride. Davenport Auto Park, Rocky Mount.